Um, she is the teacher along with two others in her room. They have a student who is autistic and is physically aggressive, verbally aggressive to the student and the staff. He will say things that I can't say on TikTok, so we're just going to skip that. Mm -hmm. He says, um, oh, he has an SBA and a BIP, but honestly, I don't think he's in the right educational placement. I voice my concerns to my administrators, and it falls on deaf ears. I don't know what else I can do with these behaviors. Can you advise on what you would do or what I should do? So I can advise on what I would do, which isn't what you should do. Um, I wouldn't stay working someplace where I wasn't supported as a professional. And you guys got to lean into that. Wherever you live and wherever you work, the climate is the climate. You're not going to change that. So I wouldn't work, you know, at Dell Computers or a school district or, you know, ABC Farms if it wasn't a climate that I agree with. So if you work in a climate in education and you agree with their modalities, their processes, um, their pathology, way they do business, then stay there. But if you've already reached out to the person who's supposed to support you and cover you and it fell on deaf ears, then, then that response is your answer. If you stay there, then you allow that, right? And what I can tell you is every district, every city, every county in America is looking for amazing teachers, and it sounds like you are one. So take your amazingness on down the road to another campus.